All right, welcome to the Comedy Union, guys. Anybody visiting from out of town? Welcome. Welcome to LA. My name is Yvonne Angli Adeze Oji. I am a writer, actress, and comedian. From comedian Yvonne Orji comes a hilarious, new family sitcom about one daughter's quest to discover her own American dream while living out her mother's Nigerian nightmare. From the time I was born, I was supposed to be a doctor. My mom is a nurse. I would go all the time with her and she would introduce me like, this is my daughter, she's going to be a doctor. No, Dr. Caldera, listen to her. I want her to shadow you. And I was like, I'm gonna be a doctor. Um, and it sounded good. It sounded like a noble thing. I realized when I got to college that all the things that I was really good at were writing and reading and speaking. I should have known that um, I, I needed to do something more artistic. It's the Miss Nigerian American pageant, so, and they were looking for contestants. And so my brother said, you should just join. You know, you should do it. It'd, it'd be a favor to my friend. They're looking for contestants. And for me, it was, ah, I'm free on Saturday. And so I entered it, and they sent a, a letter saying, hey, we got your application, but you, you omitted the talent portion. Like, what, what, what's your talent? What, what talent? I don't know what my talent is. And I remember praying, honest to God. I prayed and I was like, God, I need a talent. And I, sure as day, I hear do comedy. Then started this two week rampage of like, am I funny? Trying to figure out like, have I ever said anything funny? What's funny about growing up Nigerian in America? I end up having a five minute set just, just going through my history books of things that don't make sense to me growing up in America. I was so afraid and I was so nervous. I wanted to get off that stage as soon as possible. It actually like messed me up that people were laughing. I was like, stop, let me finish. Like there's more. <laughs> and it was just crazy, but that was the first time I did comedy and I got off the stage and people were like, do you do like weddings and birthday parties? And I was like, I do. And bar mitzvahs. I'm gonna be a comedian. I didn't know what that meant. I just, I just figured I'm gonna do this. I remember my mom sitting in the kitchen. My dad was making breakfast. I said, Mom, Dad, so my, my bus leaves in a couple of hours. And they're like, what, what do you mean? And I was like, oh, well, and I told you guys I was going to New York. To do what? I, I, I'm, I'm gonna try this comedy thing. Oh my God, you would have thought I <laughs> stabbed somebody in their face. My mom immediately started crying. My, how can you break my heart? Yvonne, this is, this is not why we came to this country. What, what, you're not talking sense. At some point I just realized like, what can they really do? You, you have to make a decision for yourself. And at this point, I felt like I, I needed to do what I needed to do. And so I got to New York for $450 and just started hustling. I started my own open mic club. I got into an acting troupe. It was long road, but in 2011, I had an opportunity to do an internship in the writer's room here in LA. Told them like my story. I was like, yeah, I'm supposed to be a doctor, I'm Nigerian. And I remember one of the producers saying, that's a story. And I was like, no, not really. I was like, it's just, it's like the life of an immigrant. Like whatever, your parents say you have to do one thing. She was like, no. That's a story. You are not a doctor and you're a comedian and your mom is upset at you. That's, write that. This is what ended up becoming what we now know as First Gen. First Gen is a TV pilot about Joanna Orji. That's my family. Your everyday Nigerian Americans. Immigrant parents, first gen kids. Trying to figure out these two lives and saying, I appreciate this immigrant aspect of me, but I also can't deny the American in me. So now I need to bring these two worlds together and be myself. What was beautiful was the outpouring. People from London, people from Paris, immigrants, Haitians, Jamaicans, Indians. Like everyone was like, oh my gosh, when is the show coming out? We totally get it. My mom does the same thing and she's Greek. And it was just like, wow, we were doing the sizzle to get the attention of networks to hopefully get us on a show, but what if we do it ourselves? So, you know, we kind of had this like, the, give the people what they want. My prayer is that it changes the landscape a little bit. For me, 
creating First Gen was showing we are your neighbors next door. We are your kids' best friends. We are your cab drivers. We are also your surgeons. There's more to our story. You guys ready for a good show? There it is.